I'm going to try to do something I've never attempted before. I'm actually off the boat as it sails to this lock over here. Now, I'm going to try to get some video of the ship as it comes down the river, and then hopefully I can get over to that lock before the ship gets there so that I can get back on board. I don't feel like walking all the way to Brussels. I'm sitting on the riverbank in Vire, Netherlands, and I'm waiting for MS Inspire to pull away from its, uh, from its dock there. And here you can see me sitting on the ground on the riverbank trying to get my video shot. And here is the ship, and it's getting ready to sail past me, and it's sailing toward a lock. Now you can see Ricky up on the top deck in a yellow coat. She's actually videotaping me while I'm doing this. It's kind of a weird feeling watching the ship that you're supposed to be on sail right past you. Here you can see the ship is actually heading into the lock. Now, what I've got to do is I'm just trying to get some a video and some photos. I'm probably only going to get a two or three second clip out of all this. Shoot about four or five minutes worth of video. You're lucky if you get two to three seconds for the final video. But I'm watching the ship as it's sailing into the lock and I've got to get to that lock and get back on board the ship uh, before it sails out of the lock. Now, the interesting part, even though I did set this up with the captain, I have no idea where I'm going. Here I am on the bank, I'm walking toward the lock and actually jogging a little bit because these things are on a, on a time schedule. If that ship has to get out of that lock, they can't get me back on board. I only get one shot at this and I have no idea once I get to the lock how I'm supposed to get back on board the ship. So once I do finally get to where I'm supposed to be, I feel pretty confident I can stop and take a few more pictures, shoot a little more video. Um, Ricky's having a hard time kind of keeping up with me because she's on the deck of the ship and it's moving and I'm walking and it's there's all kinds of barriers in the way as you can see. But I stop and there now I'm at the the wall. You can actually see the concrete wall of the lock, which the ship is pulling up next to, and I'm shooting a little more video. You can see a metal railing. I'm actually going to have to climb over that, which I didn't know I was going to have to do. And the captain is, you know, maneuvering the vessel, and he sees me. He knows I'm down there. And there's Ricky, and the ship is is steaming into the lock, you know, trying to get into position. Uh, so that it can drop down to the next level of the of the next part of the river. And there's the captain waving at me, hopefully not waving goodbye. And uh, they're trying to get the ship up close enough so I could actually just step off into the lobby, but that wasn't possible. They, it was not possible to get the ship as close as they wanted to. They could only get the, the bow of the ship up right next to the wall of the lock and I needed to then step over that railing and they had a couple of sailors come down and help me get back on board. It was a little tricky because I had to uh, I have a bad shoulder at this time. It was very sore so I had to be kind of careful but they helped me step down onto the ship and then onto another concrete part of the lock and you know it turned out okay. I got my shot and I'm back on board. I don't have to walk to Brussels. <laughs>